Hello, grooming lovers. Hello. My name is Damian. This is my fiance Sanya, and welcome to the first uh, grooming salon in our country that only does neglected and matted dogs like this girl, and we all do it for free. Uh, this Hungarian pulley girl was found on the street, and as you can see, she's in a very bad condition. She's very, very matted. And some people took her from the street and gave her a bath and cut some matted parts off. But that's why she's clean, but she's still very, very matted. And I told them that I would groom her for free and there's no need that they go to another room and pay for that. So here she is. She seems to be a good and friendly dog, but she's in a very, very bad condition. The tail is also very matted, as you can see. The legs are matted. Ears are very matted and she's completely matted. I have to shave the ears. Maybe I'll save around the head a little bit, but we will see about that. The good thing is that she already has a home, which is great. And we're just going to give her a groom. I'm going to let her sniff the clipper. And yeah, guys, if you uh, have a dog that is matted, do not bait the dog because then the mats are just going to be more and more tangled. Okay, let her sniff the clipper. Touch her with the clipper. I'm doing this with this side of the clipper, so if she moves suddenly, I would not scratch her. But I think that she's okay with that. And guys, thank you so much for supporting Sanya and her mom's channel. Yes, thank you so much, guys. Cooking by Yetza. Uh, thanks to you, they are now making money from their YouTube cooking videos and I know that a lot of you already subscribed and watched her videos but if you didn't make sure that you check the link in the description of this video and give them support again it's called cooking by Yetza thank you again This is an eight and a half blade. It is about three millimeters long. And this girl does not have ticks or fleas. And this is great. Just all coming off in one piece. Okay, let me just take a picture of her like that. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's continue. Let's take this big piece of matted hair off. Okay, let's take some more pictures. Okay, that's enough. 
<laughs> There's a lot of hair here. Okay, let's take the scissors to cut this piece off. And let me take a picture of this. Okay, here you go, Sanya. Thank Spray this blade with a spray that cools, lubricates, and disinfects the blade. Okay. This soul has to go. This is a big mat here on the head. Okay, it's not the head, it's like a space between the head and the, and the neck. Okay, I'm glad I'm not close to the skin I have to be careful and do, I'm going to do as much as I can with this blade and then for some areas I'm going to use a shorter blade because shorter blades are always safer So yes, we do these grooms for free and we make money from YouTube. Yeah, the YouTube uh, helped us achieve that, uh, that we can only do matted and neglected dogs and also make a living from that oh. hey hey
and we think that YouTube is a great platform where you can post videos about something useful or like funny, interesting and a lot of people that had that though uh, that had their regular jobs started filming those jobs and started making money from that there's a lot of like car detailing channels that also have great and developed youtube channels and there's like tons of stuff that are useful that you can film and so yeah i recommend that if you have any idea of something that can be interesting or useful that you should give it a try on youtube, on YouTube like we did because who knows what will happen She has a fifth nail and toe her back leg. You have to be careful around that and not to injure it with the clipper. Come on.
Okay, I'm going to do her tail now. Her tail is also very matte. Yeah, the tail is completely matte, so I'm going to shave it off. Taking the template. Template is shorter and this area is very matted. It's always easier to use a shorter blade. So the end of the tail is very twisted. And here is the end. So I have to groom a little bit more. I have to be extremely careful around the tail. I remember the veterinarian telling me once when I was grooming a dog at the veterinarian station and I had a dog you know sedated because he was too matted and too aggressive and the tail was just completely completely matte like much much worse in this case and the veterinarian told me like do not injure the tail because uh, the dog is always wagging the tail, it's very hard to heal. Looks like the tail was broken some, uh, who knows when, but this is not the normal shape and position of the tail. Okay, the this area is done, let's do this area here. Ok, 
Okay. Let's change the blade. Let's take uh, eight and a half again and do the front legs. Okay, before that I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this head. Maybe I can save, but like it's mad shaved all the way here. So it would not look that good if I leave some here. So let's just shave everything off. Sunny is always happy when I shave the dog completely <laughs> because then she does not have anything to brush. Hmm. <laughs> well, that's not true, Damian. <laughs> <laughs> and it's just the hair, it will grow back. The new owners will understand, hopefully. <laughs> Yeah, maybe I can do something about this area, I don't know. We'll see. So going to shave this area here. You have to be careful when the eye boogers are very cold, very stick to the skin, then you should not shave it. Uh, this way it was not that stuck, so I could shave under that. Okay, maybe we can save and make a little cute face, I'll see about that. Let's finish the ears. Okay, I have to plug this here from an ear canal. Hopefully she'll let me do that. You can see she has a lot of hair here. Guys, we pull this hair out so that ear can breathe. Yeah, because where the ear cannot breathe, can get infected. It's better to pull it out a little bit more quick. Okay. 
so you have to plug this here out. You don't groom this here, you don't cut that here shorter. You pull it out because you have to pull it out from a near canal. If you just cut this area that is sticking out, then the hair from an ear canal is going to stay. And we do not, again, we do not do this for aesthetics. We do this for the health of the ear. Yeah. <laughs> Good girl. She looks like schnauzer now. Sanya, what, what are you laughing? Because I wanted to say that. And you uh, <laughs> ah. <laughs> And she's so cute. <laughs> okay, let's groom that front legs. A lot of the dogs do not like a clipper on their front legs. Not because it hurts, but because it's like tickling them and making them uncomfortable. But this dog is just fine for that. Hey. After this, I'm going to do her paw pads, do her nails, and I'm also going to cut this here on the face before the bat to make it a little bit shorter.
After the bat, I'm going to shape her again and make her all nice and even. Okay, I'm going to take the thirty blade to do the pop pads. And by that I mean shaving this here between the pop pads so that the dirt would not stick to that here and that also when this here gets matted it's pretty unpleasant for the dog and also it can be really painful if this here, here gets matted Okay, now I'm going to shape this area a little bit so it would be easier to clean for Sanya later. Thank you, Damien. <laughs> You're so sweet. And nail clipper, nail clipper. Where is the nail clipper? Okay. I'm going to clip her nails. Don't worry, guys, we'll clean and disinfect everything before the bat <laughs> okay okay I'm going to cut only the tips Clean out the front legs. Okay, yeah, I'm also going to get this here around the face shorter before the bat.
Okay, this is enough for the bath. Now we're going to clean everything and give her a bath. Okay, here we are in the bathtub and now Sanya is going to do the bathing and talking. <laughs> I'm talking? Yes, yes. Talking, Sanya, please. <laughs> Okay, guys. I don't know. No. <laughs> Speak. Hmm. <laughs> Anna. Speak. I'm shy. I'm ready. No, I'm not shy. <laughs> <laughs> Don't be shy. <laughs> Come on. Hmm. Leave me alone, Dagan. <laughs> <laughs> What are you doing now? Can you tell us? Can you tell us? Yes, I can tell you. Thank you. What are you doing now? What is this? I'm is this gonna... uh, Coca Cola? Yes, this is Coca Cola and this is Fanta. <laughs> now I'm gonna apply this dog, this best dog shampoo ever. Yes. <laughs> this is Chris Chris one. Hydrating plant. Okay. Are you happy now, Damian? Yes, not, not enough. Well, guess what? What? I don't care. <laughs> oh. What do you want me to talk? Because when you say talk, sign, talk, sign, I don't know what. Tell Especially in English. What are you doing? <laughs> I just said it. <laughs> Do you want to talk in Spanish? Uh, si. <laughs> claro que si. Okay, Sandy is not talking. She's shy. Do you want me to bait you too? No, no, no. Okay. I can speak in Spanish too. Okay, oh, speak. Déjame en paz, por favor. I don't know. <laughs> that means... <laughs> Leave me alone, please. <laughs> Just kidding. But that, that's what I can say in Spanish. So. What are you doing, Tamir? 
I'm filming you. <laughs> and I can use your phone now, but... <laughs> I am multi I can film and use my phone. <laughs> You're so quiet, then. Hmm. <laughs> you are too. Well, guess what? what? I don't care. Hmm. I don't know what to talk. The shampoo will not burn the eyes, it's soft for the eyes. After this, sun is going to be her, beat her again, <laughs> and then apply the dog conditioner, and then dry her. Then I'm going to shift her body again and do the head with scissors. And that's it. She'll be a, like a brand new dog ready for a new home.
Sunny is brushing her uh, hair on the face without a low dry because she is dry and it was very hard to dry the head and to dry the, to brush the head under the blow dry because she really didn't like the blow dry on her head but now it's okay Thank you, Sanya. You're welcome. And now I want to cut the hair around the paws with scissors. You can see how uh, how there's a long hair between her fingers left. I want to pull that all out and cut it off. Okay. Okay, poses are done, and uh, now I need to shape her body again. 
Ta-da! As you can see, the body looks much better now. And I'm going to do her head now, and then she's done. This is some of So we did everything. We shaved all the old mats. We clipped the nails. Did the pop pads. Uh, cleaned the ears. And now I want to make a cute head. I'm using the scissors to cut around the edges. So, and I'm holding my fingers at the end of the ear so I will not cut the skin. Cześć, nie wiem, ale... What is funny? Okay, let's do this here and she's done. Okay. Okay. I have to hold her head strongly so she cannot move. So I would not injure her. And I also have to hold her mouth close so she would not open the mouth 
and stick her tongue out to scissors. Okay. I think that she does not look <laughs> like a schnauzer that much anymore, right Sam? That's right. Maybe a little bit, <laughs> but I think that she looks cute. Yes, she's very cute. Thank you. Okay guys, she's done. I'm going to let her chill, let her shake and play it with her a little bit and we cannot wait for the new owner to come to pick her up. I think that they will be very surprised how she turned out and that's it. This girl was very lucky and Hopefully she's going to have a great life that she deserves. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. Thank you for supporting us. Thank you for supporting Sanya's and her mom's cooking channel, Cooking by Eza. And that's it. We'll definitely see you soon with more and more coming videos. Thank bye. You, bye.